The mantis. I just fed it. And it's two fisting it. It's got two flies. Wow, I've never ever seen that before. So every day is interesting when you see something that you've never seen before. I would not believe it if I didn't see it. Wow. We are beginning our day. I mean, it's already begun. I've already started the video, but I'm getting out. Today's a, this is the first time I've gotten out today. And we are mailing letters and, um, oh, picking up parts. Ooh, I gotta write down my mileage. Almost forgot. So on this gray day, we are on our way to pick up a pool pump for cheap. A bigger one. A bigger one. Again? <laughs> So the one that we have is what? 100, no, 300. Yeah, 330 gallons per hour or something like that. It's 330 gallons very small. per hour. Wait, what means very small? Very small. Oh. Like a puppy. Very small. No. Very small. <laughs> wow. Uh, so anyway, that's how we find a lot of our stuff, is we get it secondhand from other people. Because why buy new, or why buy like that. Why pay new prices if you don't have to pay new prices? Let somebody else take the hit for it. <laughs> anyway, uh, we just have to drive a little ways and get it. It's a cloudy day. It's, uh, oh, there we go. It's quiet Sorry. now. Uh, <laughs> stop apologizing. <laughs> we have our pump. We're headed back. It is sprinkling. Of course it stopped now, <laughs> but when I was booting up the camera, when it was getting ready to film, there was moisture on the windows. Here, it looked kind of like this, well, not that much, wow, a little bit, like that, like that. <laughs> Just not as quick, see? See what I'm doing there? Woo! -hoo. Stop. Nope. Never. So here we have all the mailboxes. They're waiting. They're waiting for me to install them, so. I'm gonna start. We're gonna go over there and we're gonna pull all those mailboxes out. I just got through doing some uh, some recon and figuring that our mailbox post is not cemented in. That's why it's so wobbly. <laughs> uh, the center one has a big old concrete ball on it, so that's gonna be interesting. Buddy, you are we get stung. yeah, stop trying to eat bees. Bees are our friend. But I'm hungry perpetually, <laughs> like I said last night. <laughs> is it dinner time yet and then uh the far box has a smaller concrete ball on it so i think that the big concrete ball in the center is the one that we're going to re actually maybe we should reuse a smaller concrete ball that way we won't need as much concrete when we go to fill it in oh my God. <laughs> God. Uh, how big of a ball are we talking about? like huge like regis Philbin, like huge like this big. The ball is as big as Regis filming. <laughs> no, Regis always used to. It's huge. Okay. Anyway, I'm gonna start doing that. I don't want to, but the quicker I get it done, the quicker it'll be done. So we need the wheelbarrow. We need the plastic buckets. We need um, a shovel, the post hole digger, and a little bit of brute strength. I don't know what that was. Apparently, brute strength is not here. <laughs> All right, this is what we're gonna use. My box came out well because it wasn't cemented in, like I just said, so look at that. There's a hole in there, it's a gopher hole. But that's my box. This right here was the neighbor's box that had a small little uh, cement. That was fairly easy to get out of there. But this one here, this is in here pretty, pretty good. So we're gonna use the chain and the truck. And we're gonna pull it out of here, it's gonna be fun.
Wow. That's a lot of concrete. <laughs> and the sad thing is, is that it's going to take even more concrete than that to put the new one in there. But anyway, so our work is cut out for us. We're actually going to use, uh, where's it at? Did I bring it over here? I didn't bring it over here yet. Uh, we're going to use the strainer so that we can strain out the rocks so that we can put the rocks back in and fill the holes with a little bit of dirt on top. Then we'll take the rest of the dirt, if there is any, and we'll use it as fill in our yard. <laughs> well, that way I'm not leaving it here. Maybe. Okay, yeah, thanks, bye. <laughs> like Angie said, this has become an archeological <laughs> dig. Look at the size of that one. Holy cow. Wow, I'm not sure, are we deep enough yet? I know we are over there. I think we are over there, I don't know. One of the reasons so why we're dry. separating the, uh, yeah, it is so dry. One of the reasons why we're separating the rocks and we're doing this right here, to separate the dirt, oh, sorry, <laughs> is uh, so that we can take some of the rocks and level it out down below. You guys are dirty, sorry. It's a dirty job. I'm sweating. Time to measure. We say 18 and a half, right? Yeah, 18 and a quarter. 18 and a quarter. Oh, nope. wow. Perfect consistency right there. Ugh. Yes, we do. Mm, look at that. So yummy. Oh, look at this piece of firework. Forever saved. Nobody knows it but us. Oh, and you guys. Well, a little while later, there we go. She's all done. Brand new mailboxes and the uh, supports will come off tomorrow. So there you guys go. She's done. Ah, oh, look at her. Isn't she so beautiful? Look at that. Mmm, so nice and clean. Don't know what to say. Got the mailboxes done. Happy about that. Where's... Oh, Buffy's in the other room. Coda, say goodnight. Good job. Good boy. Buffy, say goodnight. Buffy. Good girl. Okay, let's see if we can do three for three. Angie, say goodnight. Angie, say goodnight. Oh. Nobody say goodnight. <laughs> goodnight. Uh -huh. There's a bread. So, the oven works. The Yay. oven works. Oh, yummy, yummy, yummy. It doesn't have a lot of loft to it. Oh, shh. Stop. She's amazing. But it smells good. Mm, it smells wonderful. Now we have sourdough bread again. Yay. All right. She's already said it. I'll say it now. Happy hunting, guys. Bye. Good night.